Welcome to Figure Feedback. My name is Jeremy, back again with the Flash Forge Adventure 5M 3D printer. And uh, one of the questions that I've gotten about this printer is can you pause a print right in the middle, take out the filament, and then use a different color filament and resume the printing? So basically, can you have multiple colors on the exact same print? And that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to be testing this out just by printing a Benchy here. And the way that I'm going to do it is I'm going to I'm going to pause it at a random interval and I'm going to swap out this green filament for another color. But here's a little tip. When you are printing, if you go to this menu right down here, it'll show you details about your print, such as the speed that it's currently printing at. And it'll also show you the layer that is currently on. So as you can see, I'm on layer 40 out of 240. I'm gonna stop it about halfway through and swap over to a different filament and we'll see how that whole process works. All right, so I'm about halfway done with this print here. So I'm gonna pause this and I'm gonna leave this running so that you can see exactly what happens. All right, so the print head is moved to the front and the benchy is just kind of sitting right there and it is paused. So I'm gonna just change the filament. And if you wanna see a dedicated video about changing the filament, I'm gonna leave a card so that you can check it out. But what I'm gonna do is pull out this tube from the print head and I'm going to cut it, cut that filament and I'm gonna remove it. And now I'm gonna take some new filament, which is this yellow filament. And I'm gonna put this on the spool holder on the side of the printer. And I'm gonna run the new filament up through the tube until it comes out the other side. Now I'm gonna go through the process of swapping this filament. I'm gonna hit the filament icon, the third from the top or the bottom right there. I'm gonna to go to the filament swap option, which is right here in the middle. I'm gonna select the PT, PETG option here, and I'm going to hit start. So when you pause the print, the hot end starts to cool down. And now that I'm telling it that I want to swap, it's heating it back up to the default 240 degrees that it has for PETG and it's going to extrude the rest of that green filament once it's finished heating up. All right, so we can see the filament is extruding right there. And now I'm going to take the new filament and stick that down. It's gonna extrude the rest of the green that's in there and it's also going to extrude the yellow as well. Now just kind of keep in mind that this is away from the print. If you are printing on the entire bed, then of course this purge filament is gonna be closer to the model, but you know, the, the print head is gonna to go to a spot where you don't actively have something that's printing, you know, like around where the purge line is going to be. So let's finish. Let's wait for this to finish purging. It purges too much filament in my personal opinion, but let's just let it do its thing. So now that that's purged, I'm going to take this, that's the purged filament, away. And now I'm going to go back to the home menu. You see that it is still paused and I'm just going to hit resume. So now it's heating back up. And then it's gonna start printing again with the new yellow filament. So now it's starting out right where it left off. It's putting the yellow on top of the green. We're gonna give it a moment so that, uh, you know, those layers can build up and I'm gonna come back and show you what it looks like once the layers are built. So here's a look at the Benchy fresh off the print bed. We see that we have two different colors on it. So swapping the filament to get two different or two or more different colors is totally possible on the Flash Forge Adventure 5M. And that is how you do it. So that's it.
Thank you all so much for watching. Till next time, take care of yourselves, and I'll speak to you soon.